Hello there. I hope you can hear me over the noise. It sounds incredible in here. Today we're at Arros Park on the Earl of Mull. Um, I'm currently between the Lower Falls and the Upper Falls and I'm just literally walking along the river catching these beautiful rapids. The rocks are black. There's green moss absolutely everywhere. Looks stunning. Show me in a minute and we'll get a couple of photographs along this stretch of river. So my first little shot, I'm going to do a vertical and an horizontal of these green boulders, you catch them with this green moss and the river running up with all the rapids, looks beautiful it does. Um, I'm going to uh, try and get a slow enough shutter speed to slow the motion down but also to try and keep detail in the water. Um, I'll talk you through the back of the camera right now. So for this shot, my settings for a start are ISO 640, F11 and that's giving me a sixth of a second which should keep detail in the water which is what I want. I tend to shoot about a six to an eighth of a second for water. I just find you get that better detail in the splashes. Looks great, it does. So I'm going to focus stack it on the rock there, on the rock there and that will be the shot really, just two shots. Looks beautiful. So we have just took this as a vertical and as an horizontal. Uh, the horizontal I'm just using from the bottom right hand corner coming up as a leading line, using the river as a leading line as well. Um, I'll put both these images on for you right now. Drop me a comment, tell me what you think of them. So while I'm here, I'm now going to uh, take a quick shot of the lower fall. Um, I'm right by it, so I might as well get the shot really. It does look really nice. When I just get down there, there's a little viewpoint looking out to the town of Tobermurray. You can get some beautiful shots along here of all the coloured houses. I have got a 70 to 200 with me. Hence I'm out of breath because the bag weighs a ton. Um, negotiate these steps. You'll probably hear the noise of the waterfall coming now. So I've walked pretty much three quarters, say three quarters of this river with all the little falls and stuff. And I've just been picking out the best little spots. Just look at that business. Absolutely stunning. I'll just walk you down to this little viewing area and I'll show you Chauber Murray in the distance. Don't know how well you're going to pick it up on the GoPro. It does look beautiful. Arras Park on the Isle of Mull, if you come to Mull, um, spend a day around Arras Park, it is beautiful. There you have the town of Tobermory. We walk onto the bridge. There's a lot of trees on the bridge. So I don't think the photos will be that good from here. I may try to get down here in a minute. There you go. Let's go and get some photos. I'm excited. Just spent pretty much half an hour trying to get down. Um, it is just too sketchy. The rocks are moss covered, so slippery. 
Um, I just want to try and get down on the rocks down here. Show you down there. But I just can't. It's, I think it's too dangerous. So, I've had a good walk round and the image that I'll put on now for you, it's not the best. Um, it still looks beautiful. I mean, this is one of those scenes that look absolutely stunning to the eye. I don't think it's going to be that good on the photograph. I've shot this again. I've altered the ISO to 320 again to give me an eighth of a second, um, just so that I can try and get some detail in the water. There's nothing worse than just having a second or two second exposure, and it's just one milky mess. Looks awful. Don't do it. Get your shutter speed round about quarter to an eighth of a second, maybe a tenth of a second, and you'll have much better detail in the water. Looks beautiful though, looks beautiful. Put the photo on for you now. So, I've walked up, probably another half a mile. There's little cascades absolutely everywhere, they're beautiful. I think I'm done here, I'll have a walk back to the car. The thing I like in here as well, just turn you around here, everything is absolutely moss covered, it's green, it's absolutely stunning. The green moss in here just looks Oh, it's awesome. There are little tree ferns growing everywhere. Out the old dead stumps. Just look at this business. Absolutely fantastic. So, I'm going to head back to the car. I'm getting hungry. I've had no breakfast this morning. When I looked out the window and I saw the orange in the sky, in the clear sky, I uh, just got my stuff and I, I left the house, I left the B&B to go and get um, some photographs this morning with the sunrise, so I've come straight up to Tobermurray, to Arrows Park and I'm now starving, absolutely starving just look at this green everywhere you look there's videos to be had absolutely everywhere in here and photographs. Oh, it just looks incredible. Look at this. Absolutely incredible. Incredible. So, as always, please like and subscribe to the video, to the channel. Uh, check the links out below. There's a link in there to my sister and brother in law's guest house, which is where I'm staying. There is also a video on which I'll put a link up here so you can have a look if you fancy the Isle of Mull check out the video it's a self-contained annex self-catering uh, you left to do whatever you want it's absolutely fantastic Lynn and Steve are both keen photographers and they've got vast knowledge of this, this island for some reason the GoPro just turned off uh, yeah, that can help out with settings and locations. Um, they're really friendly, very knowledgeable on the uh, island. So yeah, I'll put the photographs on now, and until next time, take it easy.